Welcome to our devos this week where we're dealing with the full armor of God, where we tackle the Apostle Paul's, one of, it, one of his greatest pieces of advice about what we ought to do in response to attacks from the enemy. He gives us a list of ingredients that go on our armor that keep us from falling victim to the enemy's attacks. And one of those pieces is something called the breastplate of righteousness. The breastplate of righteousness. When a soldier will put on a breastplate, of course, the reason why it, it, this is even a big deal is because everything vital is here, right? We have a, all of our organs, but specifically the breastplate is to guard the heart. So the Apostle Paul says here that we should put on the breastplate of righteousness. When we think of this, the most important thing that you have to realize when you are under attack when you have given into temptation, when you're about to give into temptation, or when you are dealing with a trial that's so big that you don't know how to handle, you have to remember something that most of us tend to forget. The moment that you had an encounter where you met Jesus and Jesus changed your life and it's never been the same, Jesus gave you a new heart. This was uh, promised in Jeremiah, promised in Ezekiel, that he would give his people a new heart, that, the, that God would actually change our heart made of stone and give us a, stone, a, a heart made of flesh. Now, this might not be significant when you're like, well, what does this have to do with me having temptation or what does this have to do with me going through a trial? It has everything to do with it because the person that you were who can't handle anything and who struggles to take the next step is not the person that God has created you. As a matter of fact, you're a child of God. And he took that wicked heart and he took it and he replaced it with a heart that is pure, a heart that is righteous. The Bible says that we have the righteousness of Jesus. He took our unrighteousness and exchanged it for his righteousness. So the moment that you're under temptation, the moment that you're stressed about a trial, I want you to realize I am in Christ. I am his child. My heart is not a heart of the flesh. My heart is a heart given to me by the Spirit. And because of that, I am righteous in his sight. And because of my righteousness, I can withstand temptation. I can submit to the Lord and allow God to give me a way away from this temptation. And I can overcome even when the situation seems completely out of my control. Keep putting on the armor of God. Make sure that you remember that you have the breastplate of righteousness that Jesus gave you so you can suit up and stand firm against the enemy's attacks. 